Welcome to Mechanical Tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like part modeling, surface modeling, sheet metal enclosure design, plastic components design, product design, reverse engineering, simulation and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain how to project or insert a decal on 3D model. So decal is nothing but a logo or image. So I am going to explain how to insert this uh, decal in the 3D model. And uh, how to insert a custom logo or label. This is custom label. And I am going to show you how to place a logo or decal on flat surface. So before explaining, I am going to show you. So what is the purpose of this? See, generally, when we create a new product or new label, then we have to show the presentation. So generally, we use this for show presentation. And uh, when we make a new product, so we want to show the product in realistic manner. Then we have to create a decal and paste on the 3D model. See, generally we get uh, some free images. See here, they have taken from pixels. We can type what type of image you want. So, so I have selected one of the image and downloaded it. To my local drive. See here, this is the image. So these are the free images. Or else, if you want to customize, see here. So we can paste any image and a text, any label, and we can save it as. JPEG. See here. So after saving, we can use this on the 3D model. See here. So this is the simple label I have created. This is customized. So let's start now. See, this is the 3D model. So here, right side, you can see there is a decal icon. Either we can click here directly straight away, you can go to the decal command, or see here generally we go for appearances, scenes. So, here we can see this. So, we can go from either ways. So, I am going to select this label. See, left side you can see design with solid works. See, this is the tab image tab. So it is showing the location also. And next, I'm going to show you the customized one while how to browse and uh, select the uh, custom designed logo. So here we can see mapping. So for mapping, we have to select the surface. See here, select the geometry. Then we can see other options. Click here see here it is showing cylindrical so here when we move here it shows up and down so we can set the height then when we come here downwards see here we can use this for 
rotating or increasing and we can increase the height so vertically or horizontally this is for angle so which angle you want to show this see here see after placing sometimes the logo is inserted in a reverse direction or you want to flip that you want to show it as a mirror see this is the mirror direction so if you want to show the reflection or like that if you want to mirror vertically we can mirror vertically see here so this is also we can use for reflection so i'm slightly reducing see here and say okay so this is how it looks like see here suppose if you want to modify the decal so we have to select the display manager and here we have to modify say so right click and edit so there is a one more option illumination so this is for rendering so when we move inside up and down so you can see the contrast or brightness you can see here we can increase this so there are many more options see here transparency you can keep the transparency also so there are many options in the illumination so we can set the brightness or transparency as per our requirement now i am going to show you how to place this custom label so i am going to hide this so we can hide this decal in the configurations so right now i am going to hide this see one more method is we can straight away right click and select this option so we can go to mapping and all this see here. decal right click okay this is one more method so i am going to select the image from browse so i'm going to copy this path see here i'm going to select this rows so which i have created earlier this is the custom image see here after importing we have to select this face see here and uh, we can move the direction wherever we want increase the size up and down see here or we can manually move increase the size so we can do it from graphical window and say okay so this is how we paste the custom label label we can design in powerpoint or uh, photoshop so now i am going to show you how to paste a or insert a decal on flat surface so i have already explained earlier see if you want to show the presentation or you want to create a 3d cad model and uh, you want to show this kind of uh, 
image then we have to use similar procedure so I am going to insert a decal so I am going to select the the sunflower image so after selecting this image we have to select the face see, see here I am going to show you in the top view see it is pasted in reverse direction so we have to go to mapping here see here keep it in 180 degrees and if you want to increase the size so you can increase size in this one and if you want to move to the center So, this is how it looks like. So, you can keep it in isometric. So, these are the different methods to place a decal on 3D model. Thanks for watching.